guys so it's been a little bit since my trip to lisbon which was honestly the most fun best time like it was just so much fun and i loved every moment of it but i'm actually kind of about to be done with my first semester of my second year which is crazy since i've got back from my trip i've been working a lot because there's a ton of essays now that like the semester is coming to an end so it hasn't been too crazy over here, but today I went to my classes, I ran errands, and tonight I'll probably hang out with some friends and potentially go out, not sure yet. But this weekend is actually really exciting because my friend Zoe, who's abroad right now in Amsterdam, is coming to visit me for the weekend. So I get to show her around St. Andrews, give her the tour, you know the drill. But yeah, that's kind of the update. This has definitely been the best semester of my St. Andrews experience, like so fun the best time, but it's coming to an end in like, I think a week and a half, two weeks, and I'm going back to Palm Beach. So yes, that's my update, and I guess I'll see you guys a little later. It's currently almost 8 p.m. I'm leaving to go to Iris's house. We're gonna hang out for a little, and then Iris and I and another friend are going to go to dinner. Our reservation is at nine, and then I intend to go out after. So that's the plan. I'm thinking if there's anything else, but I will obviously take you guys along for the night. <laughs> we are outside of the spider was not the size Aikman's, of this whole Which is a pub. Do you want fruit? Yeah, let me see the fruit. Yellow parrot. Who are they? Actually, she's, she's still, is, still is yeah. the tropical princess. She's fucking beautiful. She is beautiful. vlog i'm with zoe she hey. came from amsterdam she's abroad in amsterdam and she's visiting for the weekend we're gonna go explore st andrews i'm gonna show her around and so we're gonna get a coffee because it's like 10 a.m and what else we'll go out tonight we'll go to dinner you said it all okay <laughs> It hasn't been sunny in so long and it's finally sunny and it just makes everything so much better. Like I'm so happy. Still walking around the town. We're gonna go to Ava's house really quick, say hi to her. And it's freezing. it is freezing. And then we're gonna get like something to eat, I think, from this little healthy place called Five Acres. <laughs> we're just having a drink and then we're gonna go out. I'll tell you the full plan later. So, so good. So we're going right now, Zoe and I, to Don't Walk, which is this fashion show it's not the actual fashion show but it's like their launch party we're going to the after party and then there's after parties for the after party if that makes any sense i don't know if that did there was a dinner and then an after party and then another after party and i sound congested because it's so cold outside but that's okay anyways we're gonna go have the best night ever i'll show you guys my outfit and then i will take you guys along for the night Means so. oh 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 t t d honestly o oh, t n <laughs> Good morning 
church. I said good afternoon. Last yeah, night was yeah. so much fun, but we did wake up late and did get a late start to our day. We're heading to lunch, late lunch, at the Rustics Hotel. And then, so we leave tomorrow at 12. So tonight's yeah. her last night, but we're gonna go to the Vic, I think, and show her that. I want Zoe to let everyone know her thoughts on last night. Um, I had so much fun. We went to the event and then a house party. It was like, the event was like in the middle of nowhere, but yeah. it was cool. It was cool. And the house party felt like a frat at a, like a university <laughs> in America. Zoe and I were sharing this sandwich for lunch. Hey vlog, we just ate. It was so good. Picked up buyers on the way now. We're going to the grocery store. Freezing cold. Hey vlog, so we just got ready for the night. We've been hanging out. We just like went to lunch, walked around, went to the grocery store, relaxed, and now we're heading to dinner. Back in our same spot. As, as always. I know. <laughs> we're always filming here, but um, we're going to Lupo's, which is an Italian restaurant, and then we're probably gonna go to the Vic because I want to show Zoe the Vic. So excited. So today was my last day of classes for the semester, which is absolutely crazy. It was seriously the best semester. I had the best time, but it is definitely time to go home because I am desperately in need of some sun. The sun has been setting before 4 p.m. It is so cold, so dark, so rainy. So it's time to go home. But yeah, I just kind of wanted to conclude the St. Andrews vlogs, obviously just until the second semester when I go back in January. So anyways, I guess I will see you guys once I'm back in Florida. Hey guys, so I'm back in Palm Beach for, I guess, almost two months, which is crazy. I have the longest break. I'm here through December and a little bit of January and it's been so nice so far just to be home. I just can't even tell you American food, like my coffee, for example. It is so amazing. I miss it every day in the UK and I finally have it. I also have deeply missed the sun and like being outside and just like enjoying it being outside. So it's just been amazing. And of course being with my family and my sisters here. So we've been reunited, but I'm going to dinner tonight. And yeah, that's basically the plan. I got here yesterday. So I'm like still jet lagged and everything, but it's been so nice so far. <laughs> So I just got ready for the night. It's another Palm Beach night. Tonight's really fun because on Mondays there's something called trivia at the Colony Hotel. And I've been before and I think I've vlogged it. But you basically just like go in groups of big friends and then you play trivia. But the questions are basically impossible. But you like eat and drink and there's like tables and winners and it's like really fun. But today I played tennis. I went on a run. I did some errands, worked on a YouTube video, and it's just been a beautiful, amazing, relaxing, but like also productive day. So anyways, I think that's everything. So I'll show you guys my outfit and then I'll see you guys there. Hey guys, so tonight is Thanksgiving Eve, if you will, and obviously that's a pretty crazy going out night, I think, because everyone's home for Thanksgiving, and then everyone's like, oh, let's just 
all reunite from high school. So I'm going out tonight. First, I'm going to a pregame and then my friends and I are obviously going out, but it's honestly pretty crazy seeing your friends from high school and then literally also elementary school but it's so fun. So I thought that I would take you guys along for the night. I'm wearing this outfit that I really like, honestly, but I've worn it in LA and in Scotland and I have yet to wear it in Palm Beach. So I guess I'm debuting it tonight. Anyways, I have to leave, but I will obviously take you guys along for the night. This is the part of two piece the one with the act and I could do. What up, vlog? Harrison, Blackout Wednesday. Wow. I wanna wish everyone a happy Thanksgiving. Well, I'll Let's get bottle, out there, but though. I don't know. I don't I just filmed a little something, but it's not gonna be for this video. It just didn't feel right. This is what feels right to kind of conclude this vlog. But I'm obviously back in Palm Beach. I've been here for a bit. It's been so nice. I've basically just been like working out and relaxing and just like enjoying the outdoors. There was a week where all of my friends were back for Thanksgiving, but they had to go back to school for I think like two weeks because I don't know, that's how American schools work. Thankfully, I don't have to go back for two weeks after Thanksgiving because frankly, I couldn't do that. I physically could not get on another nine hour flight. Well, it's technically seven and then two and a half, but like the layover coming home for some reason is like 25 hours of traveling. Going to Scotland is not that bad, but traveling home, like that process is just brutal. So yeah, could not do that, but I'm just here. All my friends went back to school. So it's definitely gonna be like a relaxing two weeks, which I don't mind because I've had like a very busy semester, but I'm trying to think what else is new. I'm so excited for Christmas. And also I'm giving like such good gifts. I have to like give myself a pat on the back, I think. Me and my sister really worked together to find some gifts for our parents and we did good. I think, I mean, hopefully, but we're really proud of ourselves. And obviously I'm also excited to open mine. You know what I mean? I'm not gonna lie. That's also very exciting, but also just like the Christmas spirit. It really gets me. It gets me good. Um, I think that's everything. Oh, you know what happened to me that I can tell you that's not very good? I cut my finger open. Obviously, there's a band-aid on it. Could you imagine if I just showed you the wound? And it looks very mild, you know what I mean? But no, it was a crime scene. I literally have never seen so much. I don't even really actually want to go into this in case you're queasy. Like, I'm just getting a little bit nauseous thinking about it, but it wasn't pretty and I can't use my right thumb. Who knew how important your right thumb was? I didn't really realize, I guess, which might sound dumb, but I didn't ever consciously think about how often I use my right thumb. It's the little things, but it'll all be okay. It's literally just a wound, but it has made a little bit of an impact on my week. So I'm just hoping that it's like completely healed by the time my friend Elizabeth gets back home because we play tennis all the time when like we're both in town and we played a little around Thanksgiving, but she obviously had to go back to school. Not the point. When she gets back, we're gonna be playing tennis every single day. It's like my favorite thing in the world. I don't know why. I used to not really love it as much, but I think it's because I like played on teams. Like now it's simply just for fun, you know? Like I don't have to go to matches and play singles and doubles. Like, so I think it's just more fun now, but I did like it. Like I went to Montreal for three months and then I did this tennis camp there. It was like with the, all of these amazing kids. I remember it being fun, but they were really good. And they also all spoke French and obviously I didn't. And I was just like, great, great. This is great. Okay, so that was my rant on tennis as if any of you care. I don't know what that just spiraled into, but anyways, I feel like this is going on for no reason. So I'm gonna go, but I will see you guys soon.